Hey now everyone, it's Steve Severs for Bionic Buzz. We're here in Austin, Texas for Southwest by Southwest. This conference has so many cool things from amazing technology to movie screenings to tons of live music and so much more. Now before we get started, please give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Now let's go see who we can talk to. All right, my friend, uh, before we get into your uh, episode and the series photographers on uh, coming to Disney Plus on Nat Geo, here at Bionic Buzz, we're all about people's passions. Where'd your passion to be a photographer come from that led you on this amazing journey? Well, I just never felt like I was a smart kid growing up, but I always loved, you know, art and being outside. So it was actually my mom, like, in high school, I didn't know what to do, and she's like, well, why don't you go into photography? But it was funny, I was like, well, how the fuck do you make a career out of photography? <laughs> <laughs> but I enrolled in university, because I didn't know what else to do, and I absolutely sucked at uni. But... I don't know, things started to click, excuse the pun. And from there, I've just never looked back. I, I just absolutely adore photography. Well, I mean, you, I think you had a different approach to photography than other people. Now you're in like the base jumping, and I mean, you, you, it shows so much in the episode. I don't want to spoil too much, you know? Yeah, there's definitely a lot, but the reason why I love the adventure and now the storm chasing is just, I get to do different things every year. Whereas for some who perhaps, you know, all they shoot is surf or skiing, Sometimes you can get too much of a good thing. Yeah. And so I remember meeting this uh, incredible photographer early on in my career. And he said, you know, like after 20 years, it just becomes another wave, another island. And it just made me realize he just had too much of a good thing. And I think it's important, like, I will shoot climbing a lot at the moment, but maybe next year I'll shoot a lot of free diving. And I'm like, oh, I'm so excited to get back to that because, well, I haven't done it for a while. I will tease one part where you're in Pakistan and you have a really gnarly injury. I mean, I, I don't know how you survived, but you did. I mean, it just shows you how strong you are. I guess let's tease a little bit of that so people can watch. Yeah. yeah, I mean, honestly, if you Google my name, those accident photos are usually oh, really? pretty... Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> I think the whole smiling in a stretcher with an eye swollen shut and, like, the scar's still there. It's pretty faint now. Uh, but I, I have been known, in fact, for a while, I felt like my career was to find that, oh, Chris was injured again. Like, what did she do this time? And <laughs> I mean, even now I'm walking around on a broken ankle because I broke it two weeks ago oh, wow. uh, in a rock climbing accident. Whoops. Uh, but no, the Pakistan one, like, I was super fortunate to be able, well, I didn't walk away, but I did, you know, yeah. I got away pretty lucky. Like, I mean, it could have, I mean, like any accident, there's always a what if. And of course people say, well, you could have died. It's like, well, yeah. yeah. But I didn't. Like that's you could have died walking down the street here today. Exactly. So, so yeah, it, it was the most intense accident I've ever been involved in. Well, you mentioned the storm chasing, so you're back here in Texas. It is part of the episode where you're chasing tornadoes, basically here. Oh yeah. You know, how was I, that? I love the Texan Panhandle. Are you yeah. kidding me? Like, it's before storm chasing, I just never knew about the beauty in the Midwest. Mm -hmm. And once I came storm chasing, I so look forward to like, for example, if I, whether I land in Texas or. One storm chase, we landed in Colorado, and it was one of the first time I'm like, get me east of Denver Airport as fast as we can because that's where the action is. Yeah. Whereas normally I would have just gone to the mountains, but no, American Midwest is incredible. Beautiful. All right, uh, anything coming up before I let you go? Are you allowed to talk about? Uh, not entirely sure, to be honest. Like, I have a few project ideas that are in motion. Yeah. I honestly, I, I had hoped to go back to Utah on this trip, but with the broken ankle, it's like, yeah. I just can't do it. So I go home, cool. rehab. Uh, and then see what the year brings. Uh, where can people follow you on social media? Uh, Crystal J. Wright. So, yeah, the, I missed out on my name because I was too slow to the Instagram game. So. <laughs> You're too busy going around the world shooting. I was so cynical about it, to be honest. <laughs> then at some point you succumb to the pressure of like, all right, I'll get on yeah, Instagram. Yeah. I was late, but anyways. <laughs> awesome. Well, so, keep up the amazing work, my friend. Pleasure talking to you. No worries. Thanks so much.